Hey, what's up everybody? This is Dom and today we are checking out a new Cydia tweak called Camera Tweak. And this tweak is available in the Big Boss repo for 99 cents. It gives you quite a few different options for the photo camera and the video camera such as separate focus and exposure views, a lapse timer mode, timer mode, composition overlays, resolution settings which is insanely awesome and frame rate settings too so let's go ahead and check out the tweak here like I said it's called camera tweak so when you open the camera here you'll see we have this little Apple style button right here at the bottom and we also have this new little toggle right here as well so let's go ahead and check out the options here real quick inside of the camera mode we have dedicated focus and exposure views right here so we can kind of set those accordingly focus on different areas it's actually very very useful and we can toggle those on or off as you please and you just drag them all over if you want to reset them just tap in one spot they'll reset and then we also have a time lapse mode where we can decrease or increase the seconds here and start it and it'll kind of count them down like that it's it's done very well and for 99 cents you really can't beat this tweak then we also have timer mode here which can be set to any interval of seconds here and you can just set it to count down and take one picture. Also in the settings here we have composition overlays and if you can see that, I don't know, there's like a little swirl right here and we can actually scroll through this and change it to like a grid, we can change it to a perfect square. There's a few different composition overlays in here and it's pretty cool, just another added feature and then we can always switch back to normal mode right here. Also down here in the corner we have a white balance lock and we can just simply tap on that to lock in the white balance or we can tap and hold on any of these to lock in the exposure or the focus or we can actually hold on the white balance lock to do the same thing there. And then let's switch to video mode and check out the other options in video. Right here we have quite a few very useful options. First we have the same separate exposure and focus view as we saw in the camera portion of the app and we also have frames per second so we can increase or decrease this just by tapping these plus and minus signs right here and it'll go all the way up to 60 so it's pretty impressive I did notice though when running it at 60 frames per second my phone did heat up a little bit so fair warning there we also can set resolution as well so as you can see right here we have this little switch and if we toggle it on we can change the resolution here 1920 by 1080 1280 by 720 960 by 540 and there's quite a few options you can get all the way down to the lowest quality 3G transfer right there so you have customizable resolutions also customizable aspect ratios and it'll actually bar off so you can get the shots in correctly so there's quite a few options in here and it's really perfect for people that like to use their iPhone to record photo and video I highly recommend it it's only a dollar and it's in the big boss repo pretty inexpensive pretty awesome tweak I'd go ahead and check it out and let us know what you think down in the comments below do you use your iPhone for photo and video a lot if so you very well may benefit from this tweak right here it looks native it's got great functionality and I really can't think of any other reason not to buy it so go check it out thanks again for watching my name is Dom and have a great day